from KVOA, investigating for you. This is News for Tucson. Well, good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Angelique Lazardi. Today marks the 12th anniversary of the January 8th shooting where six people lost their lives and 13 others were injured, including former Congresswoman Gabrielle Giffords. News for Tucson's Gabrielle Parrish has the story. A bell ringing ceremony took place here at the January 8th memorial to pay tribute to the victims that lost their lives and those that survived that tragic day. I think about January 8th all year long. The ceremony began at a specific time, the same time when shots rang out during a Congress on Your Corner event in Tucson. My family gathered here at a specific time at 1010 because that's actually when the shooting began and it was over in 19.6 seconds. And in those brief seconds, the shooter shot and killed six people and wounded 13 others, including Gabby and myself. One survivor recalls what happened on January 8, 2011. And because of Bill Badger and Roger Salzgaber are having the wherewithal and the strength to take that young man down, almost on top of me, I was able to take a loaded magazine away from him. Those in attendance stood in silence for 19 seconds, the same duration of the January 8th shooting. This wasn't the only event happening in Southern Arizona to remember victims. The Southern Arizona Roadrunners teamed up with Beyond to host a run. We're just promoting health and fitness because so many of the people involved in that tragedy were also, that was a very important part of their life. There are events taking place all this week to honor the victims. Head over to kvoa.com. We have a link posted on our website with that information. Reporting from downtown, Gabrielle Parrish, News 4 Tucson.